Well, some good news this afternoon along the fire lines. Overnight, a team of firefighters was able to help save the town of Conconelli. King 5 Steve Bunin has a closer look. Yeah, this is basically a story about a bunch of teams of firefighters potentially saving a small town in north central Washington last night. So let's tell you exactly where it is. This S I put on the map here for Seattle. This is a Chelan, which most people may be familiar with. But then you go to Okanagan County and you go north a couple of hours, about 90 minutes is this town called Coconoli. And it's a small town, just 210 people live there. And as you get closer and closer, we'll be able to show you exactly what we're talking about. But what happens basically is that uh, the Muckamuck fire, which has been burning nearby since August 4th. That's 12 days now, probably from a lightning strike. It just took off Sunday and it led to level three evacuation notices. That means get out now for Conconoli here and the rest of the surrounding area. So from nine o'clock Sunday night till this morning, it more than tripled in size from 2,500 acres to 8,200 acres, threatening homes, uh, threatening infrastructure there. So neighboring fire districts ended up helping out they're already working. They're working so hard on the nearby Cedar Creek and Cub Creek fires. By about 9, 930 last night, the local fire chief requested assistance from the state, and they came, as did a team from California. This morning by 10 a.m., the town's Facebook page, they posted, all is well. The fire did burn down to the edge of town last night. It was stopped just behind some cabins on Mineral Hill Road. No structures were lost except for a chicken coop and one old empty cabin north of town. The fire danger is passed and so I can just show you again here on the map exactly where that Mineral Hill Road is and excuse the keyboard there but basically this road here that comes up right to the edge of town that's how close the fire is it came I should say but again this is all basically uninhabited area brush trees so there's still a danger that the wind could do some damage but as far as they're concerned the town there Conconoli is safe thanks to the work of all of these firefighters.